everyone! Today I'm going to tell you about nine project ideas for Vue.js. But before we will start, remember to subscribe our channel with the red button down there and to turn on the notifications so you won't miss anything else and to give us thumbs up if you like the video. Okay, let's start! everyone and welcome in the next video. From some time we are publishing the project ideas to create an awesome portfolio and get hired. We've already published HTML project ideas with some CSS, JavaScript project ideas, React.js project ideas, and today it's time for Vue.js project ideas. Of course, don't take it too seriously. You can take some React projects and try to do them in Vue. And of course, you can take Vue projects and try to do them in React. It's not forbidden. Uh, besides that, I will put you all the links for the previous videos uh, below this uh, movie. And one more thing. When you are going to create your Vue.js projects, remember to get familiar with additional libraries, which might be very useful. So take care about learning what is Vuex, Vue Router, and Vue Renderer for server-side rendering. And if you don't feel quite comfortable with Vue.js, remember that you can take a look at our Vue.js course uh, here on YouTube or on our blog. And for that, I'll also put you some links. Okay, let's start and find out about nine amazing project ideas for front-end developers. So, my first idea for Vue.js project for beginners is to create a checkout form. You know, when you are doing some shopping in online store, always at the end you have to pass all these data like delivery and payment method and so on. So this is what I would suggest you to create. You don't have to build all the eShop for that. It's enough to create a few components and what's great, you can reuse this uh, kind of application, let's say, in your other projects or you can think about rebuilding it and creating whole eShop and publish it somewhere maybe or start an eShop. And besides that, in this kind of project, you can try to get more, more familiar with building forms in uh, Vue. And besides that, you can think about adding Vuex and add some data from the form to the store. So I think it's a great idea to practice and about the design, it's nothing special. I think you can find something in the internet or, or do it according to your imagination. My idea number two is a recipe app. If you have ever learned how to cook, probably you know how difficult it is to remember all those recipes, how much of what you need to add to make it perfect, right? So for that, you can create yourself a recipe app. This kind of app should have three elements. It should have the main listing of all the recipes. It should have a form to add recipe and it should have a detailed view for each recipe. In this kind of project, you can practice the view router and passing the data by the road and let's say reading information by ID of the recipe. And about the design, of course, you can find a lot in internet, so it's kind of easy. In the previous video about React.js, I suggested you to try building the block uh, application. Today I have a similar idea, but a little bit different. So you can create a Q&A app. And what's the most important elements of the Q&A app? So for sure you have to have a listing of all questions. The second thing, you have to have any form for adding the questions. Next thing you have to have a form to reply for the questions and you have to have a component that will show answers for the questions. So how you will do it, it depends totally on you. 
you can add models, you can use some expanding panels, or maybe you can add another view for seeing a question and answer for that question. Your imagination just can stop you. If you have any great idea for making this UX better, just do it. The idea number four is a weight tracking application. If you have ever tried to do something about your physical form, get some weight, lose some weight, you probably used something to track your weight. And this is uh, exactly the idea of the application you can create using Vue.js. So what kind of elements this application should have? The most important is the listing of your inputs about your progress. So for example, if you are putting your weight to the application every week, then it should be listed there. Uh, another thing, you need to add the form to input data. And what you can think about is to add something to visualize that data. So to make a graph or something like that. I think it's a cool idea and you can practice something totally different. The idea number five is a job board aggregator with external API. So uh, to build this kind of application, you will need to use an API and you have two options. So first is that you are using uh, a few APIs from different uh, job boards. And the other is that you are using the API from the aggregator job boards, which already has different job offers. Uh, what I could uh, offer you here is uh, Indeed API. It's pretty easy to use it and they have many job offers and it's easy to set up accounts there. So you can try it and how to display the uh, jobs. So the first thing you need for sure is a listing and then you have two options. So you can show the details of each job or you can redirect by clicking on the listing item. Depends on you how much work you would like to put in this kind of project. The idea number six, it's also connected to an external API and it's about countries directory. Uh, when I was preparing this article about uh, projects for Vue.js, I found a great API with countries and information about each country. And then I came out with the idea of creating countries directory. In this kind of project, uh, the API is so rich that you can even try to create a filtering and searching using the API. I think it's a great idea and you can practice here the view routing as well. And maybe you can try implement here Vuex somehow. Try it. Idea number seven. You already know how to use external API, so I have another product with API. And it's building your news website. So, you can use external API. I have one for you and I will put the link in the description. And you can create a website which will display different news. You can divide them for news of the day and maybe some carousel of the news. And when user will click on the news, it, he or she will be redirected to the page where the news is placed. And maybe it's also a great idea to build a page like this, put it into internet and maybe make some money on it. Number eight. I think it's a pretty interesting project that I'm going to describe you right now. Have you ever heard about OCR? It's an optical uh, character recognition. Yeah, that's right. So what's, what's this about? Uh, you have an external API that you can use and what's happened in the application. You are putting the image and then the application sends your image to the API and as a result, you get the JSON with the text written in the characters in the computer. So it's like reading what's written in the image and parse it to the text. 
Isn't it cool? I think it's a great point to have it in your portfolio and it really can impress your future employers. And the last idea for the project is also something different than just displaying some features, uh, because this application is going to do something. So, do you know websites like Bitly, for example? If yes, then that's exactly what you are going to do. And for this purpose, you are going to use external API as well. So what you need in the URL shortener application? For sure, you need an input for your long URL. Then you need some button to call the action and call our API call, where you will send this long URL. And you need something to display your result. And actually, that's it. So, we went through the nine ideas for the Vue.js project. Let me know in the comments which one you are planning to do and what are your favorite projects to practice JavaScript, practice framework and frontend. I hope you like this video and if yes, remember about thumbs up and leave me a comment and remember to subscribe our channel and turn on the notifications because there will be the next project episode for sure. I hope to see you all in the next video. Bye!